after Samsung and Nokia, Sony has also launched its flagship smartphones at MWC 2018. They run the Snapdragon 845 chip like the Galaxy S9. But what's to look at is these are the first phones from Sony to have a bezel-less design. You're watching Internet Today Tech and let's take a look at the Xperia XZ2 and the XZ2 Compact. At MWC, we finally got a glimpse of an Xperia phone that has an 18 to 9 screen. The bezels are not very thin, but it does have more screen to body ratio than any other Xperia phone in the past. The Xperia XZ2 is a more premium phone coming with a bigger 5.7 inch display having full HD plus resolution. It's an HDR display that has better contrast and colors compared to the previous one. Sony has also given an overall ergonomic refresh to the devices as well. You'll see at the back, the phones are curved and have a better in-hand feel compared to the blocky Xperia phones in the past. There is a glass back that gives a very similar look and feel as the HTC's liquid design on the U11. And yes, while the phones are not very thin, they do miss out on a headphone jack. Under the hood, the phones pack a Snapdragon 845 chip, which is paired to 4 GB of RAM and 64 GB of storage, expandable via micro SD card of up to 400 GB. There's also a built-in LDAC on the device for better audio, and it also supports Aptex for better audio over wireless as well. The two Sony phones also have an improved camera at the back. It's a 19 megapixel motion eye camera with 25 mm wide G lens with f2.0 aperture, predictive capture, and super slow motion video support. And the upgrade is now it can do it in full HD. There's also 4K HDR movie recording on this phone, which is quite unique in its own right. Both the Xperia XZ2 and the XZ2 Compact are the first phones in the world to be able to record 4K HDR videos. At the front, the phones have a 5 megapixel camera with 23 mm wide angle lens and f2.2 aperture. Talking about the XZ2 Compact, as the name suggests, it's a smaller phone. And that is the only thing different about it. It has a 5 inch display that has same resolution as the XZ2, that is full HD+. The Xperia XZ2 has a 3180 mAh battery, while the XZ2 Compact has a 2870 mAh battery. Rest, everything about these two phones is the same, be it the hardware, the camera, or the display. In terms of software, both these phones run the Android 8.0 Oreo with an overlay of Sony's own interface. Another interesting thing about the Xperia phones is the fact that Sony has now put a new vibration system on it that comes into picture when you're watching movies as well. It enhances your viewing experience to a more exciting level. The best scenarios around here, hold it in your hands, and then maybe I can put the... So whatever is happening in the content, you feel it directly into your hand. You see, when you see the climax of the video, that's when you have the maximum vibration. And our special algorithm analyzes the audio data and then delivers the vibration range depending on the audio data. It's like adding a new dimension to your movies. And Sony has probably borrowed this technology from its PS3 controllers. But then again, it's good to see that Sony is doing something different. So Sony is essentially marketing these two phones as entertainment devices. There is the built-in vibration system. And then there's the front dual speakers that have the S-Force sound. Coupled with the full HD HDR screens, Sony wants you to give a Bravia TV-like experience on your smartphone. Do let us know what you think about these two smartphones in the comment section below. Also, if you've liked this video, hit the thumbs up button and share it with your friends. Subscribe to our channel to get latest videos on technology like this. Thank you for watching.